welcome. Today we'll be discussing how to create and manage reports within Movie Magic Budgeting. To do so, just go up here to the Reports menu and select Report Setup. New Movie Magic Budgeting allows you to create report templates that are updated with the latest data from your budget and you do not have to do any destructive changes to your column adjustments or anything within the main budget in order to get your report to look exactly the way you want it to look on that exported page. So to adjust the columns, just go up to the header area here and you'll see the ellipsis menu. And from here you can select which columns you'd like to display. And column widths can be adjusted and will stay the way that they're adjusted right there on the template. And again, you didn't have to do anything to your actual budget in order to do that. So we'll turn a few of these off and we'll explore the options up here. From here, you can turn the vertical line on or off. You can adjust your font sizes. You can select the print orientation, turn on or off the report shading, and choose whether or not you'd like the group colors to be presented in the report. Headers and footers can be managed by clicking on header and footer. And you can drag and drop tags here to create live data within this interface. And that's exactly how they will be presented when you click apply to report. And you can create more than one header or footer template using the left rail here. So let's click apply to report. And you'll see that information was rendered in the header. And you can adjust the footer area as well by clicking on the footer button. To create a new template, as you can see, we're in the new untitled print template. We can go up here to templates for this budget and select new report template. And we can retitle this my template. And now this template can be different from the others for this budget and it will receive all the latest data. To change what data we include in the template, we can click included sections. And from here, we're presented with all the options for all of our accounts. And we can disable those that we don't want to include. We can also choose from a number of additional reports such as the notes report or setup screen reports. And on the right, we can drag and drop and change the order. And let's click apply to report. Using this drop down, you can quickly jump between sections in the report to make sure they look okay. Make any adjustments to the width that you might wanna make. And you can use the pagination to jump between pages or simply scroll through. And when you're ready, you can go ahead and export to PDF or send the report directly to your printer. We hope you enjoyed this and have a great day.